Hello everyone, and welcome back to World of Horror. I am Vox Fox Clips, but you can all call me Vox Ardwolf. I am here again with my friend Cyber. Hello. You cut out there. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> all we just hear is help. <laughs> help. Help! I need help! Oh lord. Uh, but, on our last journey we did a bit of a uh, skeptics playthrough, kind of uh, horror, world of horror light, something like that I guess. Yeah, it's uh, basically the main game, but it's way easier. Yeah, so, at least with that, we got a good introduction to the game. However, how hard this is going to be for the next one, God only we'll see. knows. Yeah. We'll see. We're gonna continue, or should we like change up the style a little bit? Or sure, anything? If you'd like, if you'd like to. Ugh, I just wish some of them weren't so oversaturated. Mm-hmm. This. Uh... Oh, this one, it's, uh, it's orange. Since it's Halloween. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad idea. I'm just looking for the good one. Like, would it be this one, or would it be this oh, one? I think this yeah, one would be nice. Yeah, this uh, this looks better, yeah. Definitely creepier and stuff. Who knows? Yeah, more colors, too. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's the challenges we unlocked last time. Oh, boy. Yep. Sucker for pain. Oh, so this is what was... Yep. Okay, okay. Makes sense. So, should we customize the playthrough, or just do a quick play? Hmm... Okay, so what does quick play do again? Uh, true ca it says uh, under there, true chaos. This option will start a new playthrough, randomly selecting character, old god, and background, and more. Okay, and... But, I feel like we... Yeah, I feel like we could customize the playthrough. Hmm. Okay, when it's a uh, quick play, does is it still more difficult than the extracurricular activity? If you look to your right, we can actually change the quick play options. Oh, really? Okay, so... Random... So we could go for, like, co random combat? No, it's like a death mode. Basically, if you drop at zero, you either die instantly or have a chance to get back health. Okay. Hmm. A stand, sudden death. So it's currently set to last stand. Yeah. Should we just like? We could just customize a playthrough, see other characters. I suppose. I just don't want to get spoiled too much or accidentally like create something too easy. No, don't worry. I guess we'll take a look at it real quick. Okay. Hi. How you doing? Uh, one of the core ideas behind World of Horror is modularity, allowing you to mix and match various card packs with different content. Simply select the card packs you want to be included and continue by pressing the arrow at the bottom. I think we already have everything checked. Uh, unlock while playing. I can't unlock any of these. Yeah, we need to... Uh complete achievements. Okay. So these two are unlocked. Yeah. We can't unlock anything, actually. Yeah. Seed. One last thing. A tall man left a suitcase for you this morning. He said, you will know the password. I wonder what it could mean. So what? It's a seed. It's a seed. 
It's a seed. It's a seed? Yeah. So should we just go with this seed that they gave us? Sure, if you want to. You can do that. Yeah. Oh, so we're just starting now. Okay. So much for customization. <laughs> <laughs> it's a city of the Japan. It's just a Japan. It's a 1980X. Something strange is happening in our town. Oh no, the road figures. They can be seen gathering in the woods. They're being oogity boogity spooky. They're terrorizing <laughs> the creatures of the seaside. Wait, hang on. <laughs> Technology. Look at the boobs and the butt. Oh no, she's got an X on her face, though. So that's not good. Is that a pentagram? Nah, boobs. Old gods! The malicious eldritch <laughs> of the Eons Earth is awakening on the reality stars to crumble! The god's coming over and it's like, Hey, can I have some of that cookie crumble you got over there? No! Go away, old god! <laughs> that's not nice. <laughs> I, I just want to, I just, I just want some cookie crumble. You're going manic. <laughs> <laughs> this is the true playthrough. Like, going completely insane. Look at us, we're driving down the- Running in the 90s! It's the new way you like to be! Stop driving down the road so dangerously, says Cthulhu. Screw you, Cthulhu! Who's gonna stop us, the police? I'll have you know that I am a registered officer of your community. You will do as I say. Fuck you, Cthulhu! <laughs> The realms! The train! Look at this train. This is a, this is a bitch-ass train. <laughs> That's right, I rode in, I rode in on this bitch-ass train. <laughs> it's just, this is, this is the uh, true, true playthrough. Like, we go completely insane and nobody can understand us by the end of it. Because we're so incoherent, because we know too much. We just, we just transform into Shawgoths. Pretty much. Name Kiriririribinamani. <laughs> okay, yeah, should I okay, should I read the should I read these? Okay, okay, should I read these? Yeah, we're gonna be serious and yeah. Okay, yeah, all right. Transfer student Kiria Minami, twenty-year-old female. Could the ghost following her be in any way connected with all the weird events happening in this town? Plus knowledge minus strength starts with one random spell. Uh, on the, she the seems platform. very faceless. No. They're all faceless. Swimming team, team captain, Aiko Takahashi. 20 year old female, barely surviving after a ghost of a drowned man kept her underwater. She is determined to solve this mystery. Plus dexterity minus knowledge starts with combat speed bonus. She ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. <laughs> Yakuza driver, name Haru. 24-year-old male, robbing that old abandoned manor was a mistake. With his friends dead and mutilated, and a vengeful horror chasing him, no speed is too fast. Plus strength minus knowledge starts with cigarettes. I have a bad feeling this is the guy who's supposed to be addicted to smoke. <laughs> Teen idol, Mizuki Hamasaki, 20-year-old female. What a strange world we live in, where stopping an ancient evil is the easiest way to boost your career. Plus Charisma minus Strength starts with a random ally. Hell? Photographer Koji Tagawa, 20-year-old male. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. The government won't sweep this one under the rug. Plus Perception minus Dexterity starts with a camera. Hmm. I feel like the camera would be useful. Let's go for the photographer. Let's say there's a lot more characters we can select. Yeah, there's a lot of characters. Hmm, that'll be good. And then yeah. we have, and then we have the backstories. We can either go for random or. Uh. Uh. Okay, so we have currently, yeah. Okay. So if you choose that one. At the beginning, no one had any idea what we were up against. AKA no effect. Medical history. Cool history. Brittle bones run in your family, and you've spent each summer in a cast. You start with extra experience and bandages, but an injury may occur whenever the player takes damage in combat. That's pretty bad. I imagine that since there's this medical history thing... Hmm. Are you... are you feeling brave enough? 
Not right now. <laughs> also, if you uh, yeah, if you look at these uh, three at the bottom under the photographs, we have uh, item statistic randomization. Basically, yeah, it says there cost and statistics of all items stay the same every playthrough, but we can change that. I'd like to keep it the same at the moment. Just yeah. To be safe. When leveling up, the game will only draw generic and character exclusive per perk cards. Okay. And then we have the timelines. Timeline A. How mysterious. And ending. And whatever. <laughs> okay, so we're going for a photographer who's pretty basic, you know. Basic photographer. We hit continue then? Or difficulty? Yep. I okay. We are currently at cultist difficulty, so it's the next step after skip. Not 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 skip. Uh, after initiate, with comes after skeptic. Okay. Okay. So we would have 17 max stamina, max reason at 17. We start with four funds. So we're doing the normal. Okay. Good. Good. Yeah, good. Normal difficulty. Continue. Yep. Old gods are awakening. Your only chance of survival is solving five different mysteries. The end of the world is at hand. Wait, am I choosing this? Yeah, you can ch choose a scenario mode, which is gonna... Nah. Or... Endless mode. Hell it's no. hopeless. <laughs> <laughs> so, I guess, uh, you know... Yeah. Somewhere, a group of people gathers, trying to awaken their master. Select the old god view to view them, and select them again to confirm your choice. Boy, I really hope we don't get the ultimate opportunist again. Huh. You can't stop me! Tum -tum. So we have uh, Katak Atorasu, the spider god. Itotu, the devouring fire. Avio Labs, the Towering Eye. Goizo, the Thing Forsaken by God. The Thing Forsaken by God. Never been a fan of spiders. <sighs> the terrible spider god, Katak Atorasu, is once again awakening from its slumber. Blinded by its impossible to satisfy hunger, it has started to tear down the walls of its cocoon prison. Eternal web, you can't run from combat. Like I was already running. And there's this thing. The mirror. Vanish. Oh, I see. It, it represents the object it's busting out. Oh, that's why it was a random thing. Huh. Wow. Alright. And there's at the fire, this is supposed to it's supposed to cause the destruction of the Library of Alexandria. The perfect black marble statue has been recently discovered and is currently waiting in the Museum of Ooh for its long awaited premiere. Then there's like a mirror, which I can see I see the eyes in there. Vantage to a okay. dimension long ago has found a way to use mirrors to instare. I mean, some of these don't really affect me, honestly. Resting increases my doom penalty? Yeah, good luck with that. Yeah, last time we completed the whole game without resting once. I didn't even know I could rest! <laughs> <laughs> you know, you should take a break. What's a break? <laughs> my job kills me too much. <laughs> so, last time we did the, um, the Towering Eye. Yeah, I know. So, let's go for spiders. I appreciate spiders, but that doesn't All mean right. it makes it any easier to deal with the big ones. The Eternal Web. Kataka Torasu is once again awakening from its slumber. Blinded by its impossible to satisfy hunger, it has started to tear down the walls of its cocoon prison. Stop it before it devours us all. That's a big spider. Yeah, that's a big spider. We could use some bug spray. That'll definitely work. Oh boy. We have an item. The camera. 
technology, flash. Okay, that's that's good. That's a pretty good one. What do do I? We should do, do I just yeah, we should equip it. I'm blind. <laughs> Visit the lighthouse, of course. The ominous lighthouse has been closed. And we need the five key. This time we need the five keys. Boy, they really did a. They, it's not like we could, you know, screw off the hinges. We gotta go. Alright, let's get to our home. Mailbox is empty. No one's There's ever gonna check some... that mailbox. Yeah. Number 25 is never gonna check that, ma that mailbox. Currently investigating any weird mysteries. Yeah, we gotta go here. Uh... Hmm. Is it, gonna is it rain? going to rain? Probably. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, there's the, uh... Remember the bonus funds? Uh, yeah. In the, it's in the dresser thing. This? Oh, the, um, you see the icons in the... The icons on the left, yeah. Oh, hang on. The... Uh, <laughs> Back again here. <laughs> Something's gonna happen one day with that one day. Yeah. We got uh, nothing in our storage. Watch TV, take a bath, change clothes. Uh, yeah, the clothes. The clothes thing. It's uh. Oh right. It's, uh, yeah, that. We got one fund. Nice movie poster. Looking good. Can also, yeah, we can change clothes. We don't have any clothes, though. Uh, you see A, D, C, F. Okay. Oh! Yeah, we ain't going posh. We either be camera boy, tourist, salary man. Uh, nothing fits a Japanese horror more than a guy in a suit and tie. <laughs> Especially when that tie's loose. Okay, uh... Should we watch TV? Doesn't hurt. We were shocked by what she did. Her voice was always so calm. Someone murdered. Someone murdered. Yeah. <laughs> Don't have any VHS cassettes. It makes me wonder when I'll be able to use something like that, honestly. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Thank you. I remember that. It's the octopus. Or she claims it's an octopus. Uh, don't we have, like, a bottle that we could get? Uh, yeah, it was in the drawer that you opened when we came in, but... Sometimes it, there's nothing. Darn, that's a shame. Hmm, is there anything we could do? Uh, we should take a uh, bath. Yeah. And, and obviously get some experience. Alright. Alright, we are ready. I guess so. I'll let you read this. Uh, inexplicable and morbid events have been plaguing your town for some time now. You've marked down five of them, hoping that there is something connecting them. You can tackle these five mysteries in any order you want. Beware, your actions will haunt you and influence yet unsolved mysteries. Yeah, what also, what I hear in the background there, it sounds like you just slapped something. Yeah. Yeah, uh, I knocked over a thing. About to say, geez. Okay, <laughs> so let's see what these mysteries are this time. Vicious verses of a violent vigil. Far out fable of a fear festival. Oh, not you again. 
alarming account of abnormal arms. Oh, not you again. Bloody brief of a beckoning bulletin. Okay. Eerie episode of evolving eels. Well, that's not good. Hmm. Obviously, we gotta start off with going into the unknown, so we've either got the beckoning, the eeries, Not. or the v's. Mm -hmm. Let's go for the eels. Right? What could possibly go wrong? Everything! Eerie episode of Evolving Eels. While returning to your home, someone suddenly bumps into you. Did you know? You turn around. It's your friend living in the same apartment complex, Kana. That weird dude is back, you know? The one uh, who studies fish? You shrug, opening the door. Kana follows you and immediately enters the kitchen. A while later, she returns with two cans of soda. Aren't you curious? What weird fish did he bring this time? She grins. That... Mm, this doesn't end well. Oh, definitely. I saw the creepy neighbor carrying some jars inside the, his apartment. I wonder, what weird fish did he find this time? Will you check it out? He will surely recognize me if I try to do it myself. Please... Oh boy. So, <clears throat> are our endings swayed by doing or not doing the side quest? Sometimes yes, sometimes no. Okay, so we'll check out the seaside then. Sorry, Kana, you'll just have to rest at home yourself. Oh, they're going with yeah, me. Yeah, uh, if you look on your uh, on your uh, inventory screen, there is uh, actually Kana, there, up there. Oh, friendly, friendly neighbor. neighbor, important. Receive minus one damage from attacks during combat encounters. Ready, Ready for, for adventure. adventure. Did you hear? Th never mind. Ah, I can never talk to them normally. Also, crab feast. Uh. Crabs are feasting on a bloated corpse carried to the beach by the waves. It would be a real bad idea to search the body. There might be something on it, but we might get hurt. We have a lot of health, though, so... Might as well. Yeah. Reaching for the body, you are attacked by several crabs that don't want to share their meal. Damn it. Oh, also, it's dangerous here. Your stamina penalty increased. Minus one, so we lost three stamina. Stamina penalty increased? Yeah. If you look at the, uh, at the drawing next to it, there's like a vertical bar. That actually, uh, see, you can actually see the threat level of the location. Uh, really? Where? So it's... Uh, it's uh, the vertical bar next to the drawing of the location. This? Yeah. Oh, oh. It's minus one modifier to all skill checks. My uh, stamina and reason penalties increased. Oh, crud, okay. Suddenly, the air around you begins to, sw begins to whirl. A supernatural wave of freezing wind is approaching. We gotta brace. We have no choice. Oh, we succeeded. We leave the we leave that beach quickly. You may be going crazy, but you swear something is watching you from the sea. Yeesh. We should definitely go get a weapon. To the hardware store. Heavy tool, minus one strength. I just don't understand why... Hmm. I'll go for the hammer. 
let's uh, equip this uh, hammer. <clears throat> I guess we explore the complex now. She's already with us. Oh, great. A woman jumps out of her apartment covered in gore. Between sobs, she tries to explain what happened. She was taking a shower when suddenly the shower head started spraying blood. A trail of blood leads into the dark apartment. Eh, check the bathroom. Oh, thank God. You don't enter the bathroom. Instead, you go straight to the building's boiler room. One pipe coming from the ground looks like it's it was welded to the central system recently. Where does it lead? Thank God I'm smart. Jeez. Dude, dude's working at school, right? We could break into his office. What do you mean we shouldn't? It must be empty because he just came back and his classes begin next week. Oh God. Investigating the school, I guess. As you glance around, you notice that more and more people are wearing strange masks, unlike anything you've ever seen before. As you turn to your friends for reassurance, you notice that some also wear these eerie masks. Their voices sound muffled and distorted, and you can't shake off the feeling that they're not quite themselves. The hairs on your back stand on end, uh, on the back of your neck stand on end, and you realize something is terribly wrong. Mmm. Are they hiding something? You can't help but wonder what lies behind the masks that conceal the faces of the people. Are these even the people they claim to be, or are they just masquerading as something they're not, hiding their true identities behind the masks that they wear? So I lose more reason. Crud. The neighbor's office at school is empty. You do find a few jars, all filled with weird eel-like fish. Despite your protests, Kana decides to take one jar home. Why does Kana have to be such- Ugh. Have you seen an- Have you ever seen an eel like this? It's so freaky! Don't you have a feeling it's watching us? How can she sip her soda so calmly, staring at this creepy creature? Because she's probably insane. We could take a look at the schoolyard and see if we can yeah. get some allies. Hey, losers! Hey. Wait, new achievement? Okay. Uh... Let's observe. Kyrie is taking their pen apart and putting it back together. They seem relaxed. Michi is reading a horror manga about spirals. They seem relaxed. Cade is reading a horror manga about spirals. They look nervous. Kiharu waves at you. They look fine. Hmm. He's gossip. It's been hard to get any sleep recently. If Ooh didn't make those drawings, then who did? Have you heard about this computer program? That... If Ooh didn't make the drawings, who did? Hmm... <laughs> this person is nervous, but let's ask them. I will help you. What does she do? Give me a break. Give me a break. Apparently the female students are more willing to help. Plus one reason and stamina. That's good. Plus one charisma. That's good. And then we have Kana. Okay. That, uh, that save us, saves us from some damage. Hmm. 
Let's share a creepy story. It's just a story, right? Sorry, I don't have time for games. Okay, uh, gotta tell you now. Basically, you can... Uh, from the schoolyard, you can only recruit up to three uh, I know. people. That's why but I'm if sure. you... Yeah, but if you have uh, already uh, a follower, the number goes down to two and and go and so on. Oh, come on. That's a shame. So I guess we 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 just currently have like yeah. Clap and Clap. bow. Bow. The girl whispers. We don't have a telescope. I leave her alone. So we can't recruit any more students? Unless we, uh, one of them go. Like, one of the, the people that, that follow, are following us go. Nah, that, that, we don't need to do that. Uh, I already read this. <laughs> oh, okay. Sorry. So we'll take a look at the apartments right. again then. So you're wandering through an empty corridor, you find an old vending machine, you don't recognize the brands of soda inside, but you could use a drink. We'll get the cheapest one this time. Oh. Uh huh. You buy a can of off brand soda and take a sip, it tastes a little odd, but you enjoy the drink anyways. Somehow, dexterity saved me from this. What, the vending machine just falls over if I'm not careful? <laughs> Also, that's a very nice check, because uh, you have five dexterity. I know, that's why I feel really lucky. I'm seeing him burning some notes behind our apartment building. Let's go check it out! Is this eel even alive? Who knows? Excuse me, do you have a moment to talk about our real lord and savior? The day of reckoning is coming! Says the voice on the other side of the line. You definitely don't like the way the man on the other side of the line puts an accent on the real. Hello, are you still there? Hang up immediately. You put the phone down, a little shaken up. Just how many people did that odd man call today? God, there goes my reason. Kinda was right. Someone bur tried to burn some papers. They must, they must have been in a hurry, because some of the papers look savageable. You both returned to your apartment and tried to decipher the notes. That's so weird. Your neighbor really was into eels, it seems. You begin to wonder if spying on your neighbor was a good idea to begin with. Wasn't even my idea. Mm. Legend from the mm, perf prefecture eels tells of a small village of robbers who would kill all visitors and dump their corpses into a lake full of eels. Eels of the hmm, perfecture would lay their eggs inside human blank blank blank. So these eels basically thrive on the corpses of people. Hooray! <laughs> yeah. There's nothing I can do about it. Just seems like most of the notes are scattered everywhere and burnt. Do I carry the notes with me? At the moment, I, I will. guess you, I guess you can put them into storage. I'll carry them with me for now. All right. Keep investigating these apartments. The Tele telephone sound. Oh. <laughs> no, you are... you can do this one. All right. The telephone sounds and multiple voices are too loud for you to ignore. When you enter the apartment, everything turns silent. Oh no, not you again. You take a photo with Flash, disorienting the enemy. Uh, where do I do that? Uh, it's supportive action. 
Yeah, there it is. Minus 10 power. It, like, minus 10 power to them, or...? Yeah, to them. If you look at the um, health points and damage type under it, there is power, which actually determines... It's basically a modifier for your attacks. Oh, okay, so... Like, is that my thing to hit, or their thing to hit? This device is chance to hit the enemy successfully. Um, you are... yes. So I can blind so, them, then have a better chance of hitting them. Yeah. Okay, so we flash... And then attack. Attack boost with the... Hey! You dodged the attack. Nice. Uh, okay, what's your chance to hit now? 65. Okay, I think you can boost a heavy attack two times. I can boost the heavy attack once. And my allies mm. hit. There we go! Hey, there we go. We just had everybody beat the shit out of him real quick. We defeated the Gossip Junkie. There must be something more we can learn. I'll try to break into his apartment tomorrow morning. I wonder what he, what he's hiding in there. You shrug, non, sh non commit, commit and you, oh my non god. Non-committedly. Yeah, non-committedly. You just wish you could just throw this damned jar into the trash. We aren't even in control of the situation right now. The neighbor's just taken over. Oh no, not the seaside again. What was that? Bitten. Something. Putting your hand in that hole was a bad idea. Seeing the bits, big spider escape, you hope it wasn't poisonous. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! We have an injury. Bite. Right. Hopefully, Hopefully it'll go it... away on its own. I don't think it will. We... we we probably should go to the hospital. We should. Thinking about how stupid it is of Kana to try to break into your neighbor's apartment, you go to sleep. You spend an entire day waiting for Kana. Where the hell is she? Uh, the okay, it's the there it is. yeah, enter. Corridor A. So we could just do this to enter the doctor's office. Yeah. Because it feels like if we keep doing this, then it's like, you know... <laughs> yeah, that's what I want to do. Enter the morgue. <laughs> yeah, you you just need to enter the doctor's office. What am I doing here? Enter the doctor's office. Alright, uh, so you can uh, select your injuries and heal them. Blood loss. Blood loss? Minus 10 Minus stamina. Does that max go away? Max I don't remember if it goes away after the end of the mystery or stays for the whole playthrough. It's not that, that much blood loss! Come on, man! You feel like the skull is observing your every move. Ooh. I found a painkiller! Hey, you wanna rob me of my money and give me a new bad status effect? Yeah, so fuck you, I'm taking your pain pills. <laughs> Don't overdose it. I know, obviously. Uh... 
Considering we just yeah. lost some stamina. It's no, not it's a good uh, remember, remember, it's max stamina. Remember, it's max stamina. You That's didn't lose saying. stamina. No, no, so, no. no don't, don't use it. Don't use it. I know. Okay, let's go and take a look at it. See if she's at this fucking school. Great. Oh, now she's gone. It's just, it's just me and my two party members. You, you enter the school bathroom to wash your face with cold water. A sudden noise behind you stops you in your tracks. One of the stall doors has opened on its own. We're gonna close the door. You walk to the door and try to close it, but something is blocking it. When you look up, you see a ghostly pale hand holding the door. She. She. You back off from the toilet as the door slowly opens. A girl with a tattered uniform is standing there. Her head twists unnaturally as she makes a roaring, rattling noise. A door behind you slams shut. She. It's toilet me, ghost. the toilet ghost. You serious? <laughs> Oh boy. Uh, learn about the enemy as we prepare. By prepare, I mean screw you. I'm going to flash you twice. Uh, that that possibly will make them miss me. Not a. Mm. Ghost rumor. A rumor tells of a female ghost occupying the last hall in the toilet on the third floor. Of course. Uh, yeah, I got hit. I got hit hard. Let's see. So we need to do the spiritual actions. Spiritual actions? Like bow, the bow clap thing, right? Yeah, bow clap. Bow. bow. Uh, uh we'll clap. Pray. clap. So, uh, we need to do a combination of five, which consists of clapping and bowing. We know that first is bow and the second is clap. Now we have to guess the three, three other ones. Uh... Yeah, clap. Bow, bow. Uh, hang on. You gain one seminar but lose three re two reason. With the uh, with prey. Leave an offering. Burn a material offering. Oh god, that'd be either burning the notes or the painkiller. No, that ain't gonna work. So it, sa it says uh, you lose one funds. Oh okay, okay, okay. Can't even do that. So it's bow, clap, clap, bow, bow. You say it is. Uh. It seems that they mostly do reason damage, so maybe we should try to meditate, possibly. We could. You lose two stamina though every time you meditate. We can't dodge. We can't do this or that. Yeah, we. I guess we just have to hope you are. You're doing it correctly. Just so uh, you can just launch, launch the sequence. I'm trying to see if there's anything I could do at all here. Oh. <laughs> nope. nope. Nothing happens. You got. I think you got one ritual move right. What? Hmm. Uh. Okay, it's referring to the. Okay, we need to think. Cause you said bow dot 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 clap. Um. Hmm. Okay, let's think. Uh. All right. Uh. Okay. Look, I'm sorry, but just to be safe. I'm gonna do one offering. 
and then attempt to just dodge. Try to brace for impact. I can't even do that. I can't even brace for impact Good. properly. Jesus Christ. Okay, maybe you could try... Huh. So, okay. If you go to the level up thing... You, you see the plus one on the... At the bottom right? Okay, full log. Damn it. I bowed and clapped and bowed again. Uh, I th I hope there was like the the girl still talking, like you know, this is like the full log of the. Uh, it's because it's just it's just for the mystery, not the whole game. It was about it was a bow and then a clap, so. So we I guess you just you stuck with those two. I got three of the moves right. Which ones? Okay, so okay, uh, so you did clap, bow, or bow, clap. I did bow, bow, clap, clap, bow. I think you should follow the girl. Okay, uh, let me think. Try bow, clap, clap, bow, bow. You want me to do what? Like the follow the instructions that the girl gave you. Well, it was bow clap. Yeah, so, so we should the, try. But to the do thing is, the bow. thing is, there were dots in the middle of it, so those dots could have been another. No, word. no, 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 no. It's just, it's literally the two, the two first, first two moves. But I did bow bow though, and it said that it, you know, three moves got right this time. Hang on, we're okay. We're gonna look at this again. So bow bow could be at the end so or we... the beginning of the thing, but we know that it's at the beginning of the ritual, so. Like, bow clap is at the beginning of the ritual, and we know that there's two bows, one after the other. So what? So, it just be bow, clap, 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 clap? So maybe we could try bow, clap, clack, bow, bow. Like this? No, no, no. I said bow, clap, clap, bow, bow. Yeah. That only had one move! Crap. I'm telling ya, it's like, bow bow, clap, then... Maybe... Clap bow? Wow. See, Crap. three moves were right again! Okay, so let's try a bow, clap, bow bow, clap. Okay! Hang on. Oh! Okay, 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 maybe... Okay, the clap maybe I'm is like definitely, here, right. Okay, this clap is definitely the third one. Like, that clap is definitely the, one of the third moves. That's a definite thing. Could we try... Like, we know that the first one is a bow and the second is a clap, right? What, should we just do, like, a clap first? No, 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 like... Should we do like bow clap bow clap until we reach five? Sorry, wait, hang on. Hit my microphone. Did mean to. Hang on. Bow clap bow clap bow. Yeah. One. Okay, I feel like we should just uh, sever the ties. Hang on. Maybe maybe clap is first. For all I know. Maybe we are just remembering incorrectly. There was nope. four! Okay, I feel like we should really meditate right now, because you're two hits away from death. I know. Okay. Uh... The ghost is kicking our ass. Yeah, I see that. Yeah, if we go to spiritual actions... Uh... Spiritual actions. And uh, choose the knife thing. Well, 
That ain't gonna help. Oh, it's uh, at least we're doing some damage. We can try to meditate two times. We don't have any meditation. No, 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 we can do it the next turn. We're about to die. Okay, uh, I feel like you should meditate now. It's in defensive actions. There you go. Uh, why did you why did you launch it already? I I panicked. I panicked. Okay, uh, okay go yeah, to yeah. spiritual actions again and uh, let's start to kill this thing. Okay, real quick, I think that we were on to something. Okay, uh, okay. just uh, okay, so burn something like burn the. We can check on the girl later, maybe we are just forgetting the actual first two moves. Okay, 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 okay. hang on. Alright. So, clap, bow, clap, clap, bow, four of them were right, one of these was wrong, one of them was wrong. Yeah, just one of them. Uh, maybe it was bow, bow. Yeah, maybe. So, clap, bow. Uh, clap, clap bow, 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 bow. All right, but now we uh, you need to burn something like the money. Punch. Ah, <sighs> oh. we are not dead. Corpse dust. This was the worst thing ever. Kana has been missing since yesterday. You decide to check out the neighbor's apartment yourself. I don't have enough head! Minus two luck, but we gain 20 experience. I am going to just sell this. Yeah. I should have just- I should have just tried it. I should have just tried the thing, because we need to know this for the future, obviously. Yeah. So, just try to remember what that sequence was in case we encounter another ghost. Because it was- So, what you did, it said it was uh, four mo correct moves, you said yeah, it was Yeah, that's like, what I'm saying. Clap. What was the it move was we were clap. missing? Clap, bow, clap, 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 bow. Hmm. Like I said, we were originally going to do Bow Bow, but, you know... I should have been able to do it, because we we are dead anyways, it looks like. Oh, we don't have any choice, do we? You cautiously enter your neighbor's kitchen. You are shocked to see countless jars filled with eels flail flailing around restlessly. Where the hell is Kana? <sighs> we are not escaping. Bathroom. The swollen body of your neighbor is running away inside putrid murky water. Both his eyes are missing, with countless tiny blood trails leading from them in all directions. Minus one reason, minus one stamina. Damn it, they really went too close to this. What? You finally find Kana. I... I found the neighbor. But... but his eye burst. I slipped on the blood and lost consciousness. I'm afraid there's something in my own eye now, too. We do not have the reason for this. I think you can survive this. This? Yeah, I think you can lose three reason. Where am I puncturing? Oh, what 
the hell? Shocked, you see countless tiny eels crawling out of your friend's eye in all directions. Will can I even survive the blood loss? What the fuck, man? You rush to the hospital with Kana, getting a lot of attention from other horrified people. Your friend is taken immediately to the operating theater, and you collapse on a chair in the waiting area. Fall asleep. Wake up, dude. You've been sleeping for over three hours. You groggily open your eyes to see your friend. Kana is wearing an eye patch. Not so pretty anymore, eh? I couldn't exactly tell the doctors the truth about what happened, and I'm pretty sure I won't be winking with my left eye anytime soon. But thank you for saving my life. You're still processing the events of the previous night. Corpse eating eels that lay eggs in eyes? Sitting with your friend Kana before your apartment building, you watch the police officer emptying out your neighbor's place. Eerie episode revolving eels. Ending A. I should be dead. <laughs> the old god stirs. Reveal its effect. Did the water level suddenly increase, or is our city slowly sinking? Exploring the seaside location has the chance of inflicting the drenched status. Oh man, we are not good right now. We, are, we need to go take a bath right now. Got a key, hooray! Bath. Oh, we are still alive. Uh, no, actually, uh, do the experience. We are, you are two uh, points away from leveling up. You're, you're insane. Now, uh, level up. And you can choose to get four reason back. Alright, let's see. What do we have here? Quick thinking. Always a way out. Seemingly hopeless situations. Additional inventory slot. We're gonna go for quick thinking. Not this lady again. <clears throat> I'm waiting for it. <laughs> Why are you looking for it though? <laughs> Because there's something about it! There has clearly something about it! You can't see anything! Nice. Okay. We are not Next. doing good. Yeah. Yeah, we should definitely, uh... We still have Kana with us, at least. Yeah. At least Kana is... you know... It's Kana. still, uh... It's, it's, it's uh... It's still... It kind of is, is still as cheerful as before. Yeah. Good. Good. I'm afraid that if we didn't do anything, they'd be lost. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. How's our inventory look? We don't have anything. Right, because we also sacrificed our... Oh, we didn't sacrifice the hammer? We no. Have it? No, you, you remember, you sacrificed the funds, not the... not your items. Okay, okay. Oh, it's just gonna be... It's just gonna be surviving now. Yeah. Right, so we did this one. Bees. Or... These. Let's take a look at the bloody bulletin this time. 
loving brief of a beckoning bulletin. As the decades roll on, technology has only developed further. These days, computer bulletin board software allows computers to communicate over phone lines. It all takes... All it takes is a computer and a modem, and anybody can connect to a bulletin system, or even host one of their own. Once you connect, you can read all the messages on that bulletin, and even post your own to start a conversation. Many use them to share files or to chat about their favorite topics, everything from video games to sports to idol culture. But in the wake of a sudden string of weird suicides, things aren't all fun and games. Rumors have surfaced that the deaths are linked to a bulletin system operated from somewhere within Shiokawa. What is behind the suicides? How could so many people all be driven to, to take their own lives? Says the man with five sanity remaining. Oh, we. I did not choose the right mission. Even if the rumored bulletin system phone number is found, there is no hope to investigate without a computer that can connect to it. Maybe the Skull Library has one that will work. Forest suicide and investigate the forest location twice to complete this quest. Oh lord, this ain't gonna end well. We're gonna lose the reason, obviously. But it has to be done. Petrified forests drooping three branches hang over the path, framing it in an almost macabre way. It's almost inspiring. Get a grip. Great. You quicken your pace and leave the menacing path. Maybe we should have gotten lost in our thoughts, but knowing my luck. What you thought was a discarded pile of clothes suddenly moves. As it stands up, a cloud of white powder is released into the air. What the hell? Oh, it's a fungus man! Fungus man! Kinoko Gatherer. It's a plant-based enemy, apparently. Oh, shit. Um... Flash photography, go! And I'll take a look at him. Okay, infected with a rare mold, this man has turned into a fungal colony. Okay. Okay, I feel like you should just flash him over and over. Like... Like, once, and then attack. He still hit me! Crap. Uh... Oh boy. Yeah, he still hit me. Okay, uh... Ally attack. Um, mm. Oh, One God health Lord. left. Uh, I feel like you should meditate. No, not, not pray, not pray. Hang on. Sorry, I keep getting them confused. Okay, uh, do it. Two times, okay, three times, then prepare attack and kill. Prepare attack? Yeah. <laughs> what? What? Did you do the, did you do the, the normal attack? Yes, I did the normal attack. It, it does four damage. No, I didn't mean, oh no. Okay, prepare attack again and kill. <laughs> We are Ooh. not doing good! Yeah, I feel like this time we should definitely rest a second. After searching deep in the woods for some time, we discovered the body of a young student clutching a note. Okay, how do I- how do I go and rest? Uh, home? There. Uh, 
manage manage up. Phone talk different stuff. Time flies by. You prepare yourself to leave. Continue the investigation. Anything here that we need? No. Man, that does not help at all. Look at that. You can uh, rest again. Already there. Can't investigate from home. I can't investigate my home? Rest. Three Doom goes up. That's as good as we're gonna get this right now, because if we don't... Yeah. Yeah, we, are, we won't have a good time. Okay. Also, forest note. You got the forest note. Oh, I gotta read the forest note! No! I, I think I can do that now. I hey, write this. this. Oh, uh, mind if I read this one? No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. You go. I write this for everyone wanting to stay behind. The sacrifice is worth it. Life's meaning comes from our relationships. Share death, and that connection will outlast you. There won't be anything left but us. Everyone here is waiting for you, so if you lose your resolve, just listen to the voice of humanity. Dot dot dot. Yeah, that's how I feel right now. Okay. The, the corridor is flooded by a black sludge that's slowly oozing from underneath the door from the chemistry classroom. A damp, moldy stench grows as you get closer. How are you going to get to the other side? We're going to take a detour. Better safe than sorry. You take the stairs up to another floor to avoid the sludge. I am not getting the crap beat out of me again, okay? While the school library's computer doesn't have a modem, you happen to bump into a member of the computer club while asking around. She apparently just got a new system and is willing to let you borrow hers. Thanking her, you arrange to meet at her, at, her, at her home in the city. I got a bad feeling she's gonna be dead. Okay, so... We don't got much, but we can take a look. <laughs> you can't tell me that I'm wrong. Okay. Until That's the not end good of medicine. It. That's just dexterity shit. Plus one dexterity. For the end of the, the mission. End. Yeah. So it's gonna go back to six once it's done. Uh. Compass though, it's nice. So now you get four, if you equip it, you get four experience every time you explore. Okay. Are we gonna steal the handcuffs? Yup. <laughs> yeah. You don't know when we're gonna encounter a fucking human enemy. The moment we do, you know. I can't request the police to go anywhere good anyways. Oh, you should definitely uh, go to the- let them uh, do the seaside, though. Uh, seaside? Yeah, it was like dangerous levels. Alright. Yeah, threat level decreased. 11 XP to get one fund. Yeah, that ain't gonna help right now. Alright, let's Unless go meet our friend. Another fucking ghost. If we encounter another ghost, that ain't gonna be fun. Alright, boys, let's get a move on. Something is wrong. I can feel it. You don't see anyone on the street. You could have sworn it was crowded just a minute ago. You'd better hurry out of here. Come on! You I lug don't the want to lose more reason! You lug the cardboard box full of PC parts up to your apartment stairs. Teeth clenched as you heave it up one step at a time. God damn, our computer's heavy. Boy, are you gonna be surprised in the next ten years. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> your neighbor is a horror manga artist. He's struggling to come up with a satisfying ending for his newest story. I'll share my experience just to get it off my chest. INCREDIBLE! He shouts in excitement. 
How do you come up with this stuff? Sensing this story will be a huge hit. He pays you a token of appreciation. Did when I lose some experience? Yes. Do 16. But hey, at least you got fun you got funds. Yeah. I last thing I wanna do is like let him be like, what's that picture? It's a it's it's the bitches you aren't getting. <laughs> You wipe the sweat from your brow as you finally finish setting up the computer in your bedroom. After a few tests, you are now certain that everything is functional. The newscaster on the TV says that the suicide rate is still climbing. Worse, the morbid trend is beginning to catch on in other nearby towns. You need to act quickly. See, so we have more police at the seaside. I still wonder what happens if you travel to, like, a mansion or a village. I don't know what happens there, you know? At least the doom doesn't go up. It's like, there's nothing here. There's nothing in these places. So, we'll just do the apartments. You find an envelope lying on a pillow in your bedroom. Inside is cash and a note from someone who has been watching you. They wish you luck. Uh, we keep losing reason! Hoping to find the lead, you head to the hospital. With how many deaths there have been, the hospital is in chaos. The staff looks exhausted. When the receptionist lets her head down onto the desk for a second, you slip out of the waiting room and into the hospital corridors. Oh my god. Roar to the hospital. Let's hope nothing bad happens. I don't know if it's just me, but I think my character's forming bags under his eyes. Yeah, he definitely is. Okay. Investigate the hospital. Sunset break. You meet your, with your friend who has recently started her nurse practice. You lazily chat on the roof of the hospital, watching the sunset. He would Now would be the perfect opportunity to ask about recent unearthly events. We're not going to ruin this calm moment. Sometimes it's better not to know. You chat until your friend's break is over. Good. And I got some freaking head back. Okay. You were here, too. Maybe not like that. We got some mind back. Not head. Not head! <laughs> <laughs> you were here, two nurses talking about a girl whose suicide attempt failed. Apparently, she's recovering at her grandparents' home at the village in the city outskirts. You exit the hospital and make your way through the nearest bus stop. Through the Terror. dirty restaurant window, you notice a shady-looking man wearing a jacket covered in strange symbols. He stops in front of a house, visibly nervous. Before he enters the house, he turns around as if he's checking for any unwanted followers. What could it mean? I'm gonna call the police. You can't convince a police officer to take you seriously, and by the time you manage to find a willing cop, the house is empty. You gotta be killing me. Uh, there goes my reason. As you pull into the village bus stop, a news story comes on the bus driver's radio. An entire class of Shiokawa students slept in front of a train, hand in hand. You move urgently as you exit the bus and begin searching down the village streets. God, jeez, that's wrong. I think you uh, I think you can recognize the reference here. Yeah, I recognize the damn reference. <laughs> Duh, I just have the horrible images flashing through my mind of them all being happy and just, you know, jump in front of the fucking train. I'm just like, Jesus Christ! I, like, oh, Jesus Christ. How did I even come across that? How did I, how did I even come across that, 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 that video movie clip thing. Like, I don't know. You're welcome. <laughs> you oh. wonder what kind of animal- <laughs> Oh look, we let you lose two more reason. Uh, it's a human finger, at least. <laughs> Great! Isn't it fun? Nice spring. 
See, you got the nice ring. The nice ring? When Plus one to ring. <laughs> or you can use it to get two funds. What? Fancy. On slot C. It's the compass. Uh, I'll equip it later for certain situations, okay? When you find a girl... Oh, when you find a girl's house, her grandparents greet you solemnly. They thank you for your effort to stop the deaths. Forgive her, her grandfather says as he leads you to her bedroom. She's a kind girl. Something has happened to her. An old Amateur man. Oh, what? Amateur priest. An old man stops you and invites you into his house. You follow reluctantly, only to be amazed by the number of dusty old sorcery books inside. I can teach you a thing or two about magic, he says. Don't worry about payment. I'm sure we'll work it out in the future. <sighs> I either get a spell, possibly, or I learn something horrible about the world. We'll accept. Luck. It was a complete waste of time. The senile old man was a bore and had nothing interesting to tell you. Oh. Well, at least I didn't lose my sanity, okay. The recovering girl is more than happy to not only confirm the bulletin's existence, but to give you its number. You have to do what it tells you. Trust me, you won't regret a thing. She beams at you as her, as her grandmother struggles to make her soul the pain medication. I will join you all soon. Wait for me, okay? Disquieted, you give the grandparents your phone number and hastily leave. This is a horrible place. Welcome to the rice field. As you walk through the village, crops waver in the breeze, following your every movement. Come on! It's just- it's just crops! It's just crops! Don't let that take your reason away from you! Are you afraid of whole wheat? Whole grain? I don't know. As soon as you arrive home, you dial the number and put the handset into the modem. Your heart pounds as the computer fans exhale. The system hums. You hear a brief dial tone, and then it finally connects. Oh no. Oh no! I only have three sanity! This is gonna take five and kill me! Welcome, Welcome home. <laughs> Did, do you like it so far? Yes. I'm glad. Take your phone off the modem and put it to your ear. Remember the note. You recall the note you found. Could this be the voice of humanity you read about? Raising yourself, you slowly put the phone to your ear. You don't hear words or a voice. You soon understand they don't need those. It's difficult, but you manage to keep track of which thoughts are yours, and which are theirs. Everyone is here now. We've escaped everything that held us back in life. We don't have any more burdens. You can escape with us. This is the purest form of existence. A paradise of connection. Everyone deserves that. We will bring all humanity together. You need to think carefully about how to respond. Suffering is human. Can't save everyone. Or that's, that's, I just don't a die. that's just a downer real thing. Like you can't save everyone, but you can save as many as you want. I don't want to die. I guess it. Yes, you can save everyone is, a, yeah, it's a downer, but it's also a truth. Well, so is suffering is human. Yeah. You can escape with us as the purest form of existence. 
I don't want to die is too easy. It's too simple. It would just be like, you won't die. You'll continue to live with us. It's not yeah. that hard. It's either suffering is human or you can't save everyone. I think suffering is human. How can you believe that? Well, okay. If you want to suffer, go ahead. Your consciousness dips. By the time you snap out of it, you're strangling yourself with the phone cord. The entity assaults your mind, but the struggle brings out the strength you didn't know you had. You refuse to die. Minus 5 stamina, plus 15 max stamina. Ha! Counter to the blood loss! You listen to the static -y signal on the other hand. It's harsh on your ear. But then the noise begins to slowly change into something beautiful. You want to join it. Oh shit. We are shit. fighting We are fighting together. Shit We are we're gonna start smashing this stupid thing with the hammer. Uh, uh, actually actually I think you can go in supportive actions. In supportive actions? Just, yeah, supportive actions. Uh you see the heart? Yes. Desperate struggle. Time near to 40. Doubles all damage dealt during this turn. Okay, okay. One time use. Okay, uh... Now let's uh, try to see what we can fit in the thing. Uh, okay, the, the allies are not boosted by Desperate Struggle. Right, okay. Uh, no. The flash is not gonna work here. Like, you cannot attack. Like, there's not enough space. We do not have that much- have that- we do not have a good chance to hit this thing! That's way too many. Uh. I feel like you should just, uh, prepare your attack. my attack and don't do anything? Uh, ready the attack and, uh, and hit it, obviously. No, don't boost. Don't boost? Yeah. Like, it's useless to boost. Uh, okay. It's down to 19. Uh, can you... Okay. Uh, I guess just beat it to death. What do you mean, beat it to death? I mean, beat it to death with a, with your hammer. I don't have that much. But we gotta do this. So yeah, prepare attack and let's hope for the best. Oh, he missed. And missed. <gasps> Why did you boost? I said, not <laughs> prepare. What do I do? Okay, oh yeah, Th this might be over, yeah. Maybe we could sacrifice the allies? What do you mean, sacrifice the allies? If you go to the allies uh, tab on your inventory. Not that, on the, on the right. And if you select the, th the followers, you can send them to fight. I don't need that much charisma. Six damage. Okay. Uh, student F, maybe? Uh, oh god. Okay, did one damage. Uh, okay. Go to the offensive ones. Okay, can you fit two heavy attacks? Ooh, okay. I can do this, and pray. Okay, so it's a 40% chance and then a 30% chance. Ooh. It's either this or we are fucked. Oh, no! Kill me! Alright, I, I 
guess just prepare attacks and, and hope for the best. Alright, you son of a bitch! But yeah, we are. Ish. I ha I have no idea if we can make that out. We defeated together. You wrenched the photo from your ear, nearly tossing it across the room. You could have killed yourself with that thing. Sweat pouring down your face, you immediately yanked the computer plug from the socket. From the bulletin's number and phone book, you find the system operator's address. When you enter the cramped apartment, you're met with a smiling, hanged teenager and a still-running unplugged computer. You smash it to pieces. With the root cause gone, the suicide's eventually slow. While you couldn't save those already in its thrall, you're relieved to know the bulletin won't make any more new victims. Oh, Only man. brief of a beckoning bulletin, ending B. We got our first ending B, oh man. I wonder what ending A ends up being then. The old god stirs as we're completely screwed. Roads closed. Roads leading out of the town are closed. We're closed by the police. You'll find you'll have to find a different you know, a different way out. Investigating places located outside the city, village mansion cost more. Ugh. Damn. Please. I'm not doing good, man. We need that bat. Uh, okay, how are you doing? Uh, we have no experience reason. wise, what about experience? No, no, like, what, what? How are you doing? Okay, level up again. You gotta be kidding me! <laughs> it's the most we can do. <laughs> Luck. All we can do is get luck. And the reason. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> We're back from the brink, baby! I swear, if you manage to finish this somehow... Oh my god. We just killed two of our friends! Hey, at least Kana is here, right? Hooray! Isn't that awesome? We are screwed. We are so screwed. <sighs> some of our report, some of our readers report a strange tall man dressed in white taking a metro after dark, apparently stalking low passengers. Please avoid traveling alone. Oh, great! My favorite. Ooh. Where are you, motherfucker? I see you. I know I see you. Uh. Fuck, we are not doing good at all. Yeah. Alright, alright, alright. Should we end the episode here for a sec or try to do one more? We could try one more, I don't think we're gonna last much longer. Yeah, fuck it, last stand. LAST STAND! Let's go for this violent vigil. We could do one that we know already, so... Because oh. we're definitely- I don't- I feel like we won't make it through the next one. At least this won't get us killed. I think. Hopefully. Hopefully. The alarming account of the abnormal arms. I remember when it started, the woman next door was strangled to death in her bed. No sign of forced entry. Killer was never found, and the apartment remains vacant. Yeah, this is a this is a, this is a very, very simple one. Okay, so first off we're gonna shop. Minus one charisma. Damn. 
Uh, I mean, I guess it's the it's the thing that will save us. It's the thing that will save us. Uh. All right, let's use the sewing kit. I guess so. And now we have a nice scar on our face. It's another hardware store, but we don't need anything from there, right? Yeah. We'll take a look real quick, just to be safe. Can of acid. Nope, there ain't nothing here. Well, at least we could wear the nice ring soon. Investigate the hospital. Twice. What's to say? What does, uh... If we don't investigate this, then that means that, like, you know, this thing becomes, like, possibly is going to live and attack us. Okay, telling you now, the different ending, you get it by playing on the time, on a different timeline. Oh, okay. <clears throat> you stumble upon a nurse trying to open a door to the intensive care unit, constantly mumbling something when she turns around her face makes you scream in horror. Dull nurse. <sighs> Come on! No more reason damage! No! Okay, um, you shouldn't... Okay, little tip. Some enemies are blind. So what, we just prepare an attack and then don't do anything? No, 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 no. She doesn't... Like, she won't attack until you attack her. I want to do this real quick. I think this is an achievement. Yup. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'm smart. The only the only enemy that doesn't fight back is the safest one to get this achievement for. Oh crud. Okay. Uh it is guaranteed, obviously, but we've already got a high thing. Don't you want to uh analyze? Do we want to analyze? I, I usually do, yeah. Undead, female, weak against fire, blind, one attack, and less provoked. A keen astronomy fan. Staring at it for too long, she discovered the horrible truth about our sun. The solar worms have marked her. Oh. Oh, okay. So what, can we just leave? Remember, we have the spider god, so we can't run. Ah. That's unfortunate. Hmm. I mean, we could do the desperate struggle again. Yeah. She could be, uh... Real heavy hitter, you know? Yeah. He ain't even oh, sure. actually, 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 uh, go back. Alright, uh, take out the, the prepare attack. Uh, okay, boost two times, light attack, boost two times, light attack. Oh, you can actually boost the third time. And now, and now just, uh, prepare a strong attack. Nice. Okay. Really hating the hospital right now. Being like you're on the brink of losing your mind, you decide to visit your 
parents' old friend, Father Yasugi. Hey, kiddo, says the priest who's currently moving boxes in and out of the church building. Can you lend me a hand? Heaviest box. Oh my god, that gave me some sanity but took my heart. Lifting the box, you feel your back cracking, but you manage to get it all in relatively quickly. Afterwards, Father Yasugi invites you inside for a cup of hot tea and home-baked cookies made by one of the parishioners. You explain your situation to him, the father listens, letting you vent all of your doubts and anxiety. Oh, for fuck's sake! Yeah, the top of the museum has, a, you know, the angelified bones. Isn't that cool? We're gonna, we're gonna go home real quick and do a little bit of resting, you know? Yeah. God, the doom level's just gonna keep rising. I mean, might uh, as well. 61. We don't have much of a choice. 61%. Look, we're doing a lot better right now, okay? Look at yeah. this. We yeah. needed this! We needed this badly! Hey, look, we have a scar. Yes, we do. Couldn't we enter the hospital and get some more pain meds, or is that a no? No. No, only once. Damn, damn, damn. Isn't that a shame? Okay. We should investigate the hospital. No, we already we already did that! I'm yeah, we did, we did, we did, we did yeah, that. Yeah, we did! We could do it! More charisma! <laughs> oh! I'll take that. I'm sorry. Troll. You know what happened the last time? We fucking yeah. hit that ghost enemy? Yeah, we almost died. We're gonna take this. We might be able to pull this back from the brink, though the doom level rising like this... Yeah, it'd be a very close sh close call. Okay. Alright, let's do this. I'm going to kill! I think it's time to use the nice ring. You mean go to the hospital, get it healed, and then use the nice ring? Yes. <laughs> like, I'm telling you right now, you don't want that, uh, that bite to get worse. I know. No! I oh shit! <laughs> oh fuck! I'm gonna kill. Oh, uh, don't look on the right. I didn't- I didn't look at the- <laughs> No! Nice ring. We have to sell it? Uh, use it. No, use it. Use it. There we go. Oh. Uh, now we get rid of that. God. Stable condition. We are not doing good. We are messed up. Blood loss. Everything horrible. Everything is horrible. <laughs> All right, let's get this mystery out of the way. Oh. Stop! Fuck oh. off! A uh, we got a new ring. Uh. Minus two max stamina, though. Yeah, I ain't doing that. How do I uh sell? Just sell. Oh Jesus! Christ. We remember this one. Uh, we lost. Thank you very much. Oh, God, sake. This is a horrible place. Uh, as you prepare to think. Uh, cold bath. Fuck! So much for strength! 
We are getting knackered, as the British would say. Not wanting to wait for the for an elevator, you decide to take the st you decide to take the rarely used stairs. You suddenly trip, gra grab the railing at the last second. But you get up and inspect me. It's slowly standing up. Oh look, it's the crooked man! Yay! Oh god, no! He's undead, obviously. He's a ghost. He's a ghost! You gotta be kidding me! Do I use it? Kill it. Now would be an amazing time to test out the battle clap, 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 Sever, sever, sever. Why are we severing? Uh, spiritual action. And sever. Does five damage. Do it two times. You can fit two times. We need to ah! learn. We need to learn that stupid thing. There was okay. I wanted to examine the guy, but I really did just did not want to handle yeah, that this we, time. We, yeah, we wouldn't. We would have got a murder if we did. Okay, just let's think about this for a second, right? What was the sequence? It was like bow clap. Uh, it was like clap bow clap. We can go to the we can go to the school thing and go to the rooftop and ask the girl. Didn't we say that we weren't gonna do that? No, I I thought we weren't gonna do that. Also, oh. can we recruit these guys? No, of course not. Okay, we got one guy. Hey, well, we got one guy. What does he do? Student A. He get. <laughs> he took our luck. Guess who's getting <gasps> sacrificed first, motherfucker? That's right, you are. You're getting sacrificed next, motherfucker. You better believe it. You better believe it! Better believe it! Better believe it! Clap. It was- it was- it wasn't bow clap, it was clap bow. Clap bow? So, okay, so I was- I guess I- I got it. So yeah, you were doing it correctly, we were com we, we forgot. <laughs> Okay, so it's clap. So we got most of it right. Yeah, it was clap bow, and then you, then you, the thing you did was clap, 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 clap bow, which was four correct. Oh. We, we don't need, we don't need any more people, I guess, right? If you share a creepy story, you'll be able to recruit we them. We need that XP. Yeah. We gotta do this. We're at 80 Doom now! Oh boy. This is all about luck, and we don't have luck. Check them later. Screw you. Alright. <laughs> Loud knocking wakes you up. Call the police, maybe. Love of God, please do. The man is. Ah! Uh, 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 like Oh fuck! Fuck! Check the vent. The vent. Yeah, he's dead. Hey. Yeah, he dead. At least we got the tiny key. Ah. Uh. Minus, we get, we, we, a little bit of doom is gone. Uh, up, I guess. Gain a new level, see that? I was kinda right, we almost didn't get it. Fast hands. Okay, bonus XP for completing a mystery. This isn't good at all. We get we either get a little bit more charisma and the natural ability to guide others. What should we just do this then? If you want to, unless we want you want the extra experience. But oh, the this is bad. The question is how much is the extra experience gonna help us until we actually solve the case? 
So, okay, normally when you solve the case, it's uh, 30 experience. If you choose bonus experience gain for completing a mystery, it's it becomes 50. So it's basically we either skip out on something... No, fine, we'll skip out on something for now. Should we do more strength? Or should we just... <laughs> Reason here. Whatever, whatever you feel like it's uh, more appropriate right now. We don't have any luck, so there's no point in yeah, putting our luck no, up. No. Yeah, no point. We we have good knowledge. There's nothing we can do about that. We need more strength. We need to hit harder. Well, well, not harder, but more accurately with our current weapon. And the only way we can do that is with more strength. All right. Let's see what happens now. Blood moon. Blood moon. Great. The Crimson Moon spotted over Shiokawa keeps everyone on edge! Look at that moon! Man, everything added to the screen right so now minus, is so, so minus 20 to hitting enemies. <laughs> Hang on, let's see. Minus 20, it's 20% less chance to hit enemies. Oh my god. We're not doing good. We're not doing good. Yeah, we need that bath. What, you want more experience? Mm, you, no, I feel like... Okay, check. Yeah, I feel like uh, reason is more needed here. Dentist found implanting dog teeth. Yeah, that's amazing. Question: Do you think that we can get through this whole? Mm -hmm. How long have I we been like... doing this? Oh, no, uh, almost two hours again. Uh, but yeah, at least two with hours. the two of these, we know what they are. Mm, yeah, we still have one more right. that we don't know that you, that you haven't seen. Should we do the other one that we know? Yeah. Let's try speedrunning it, I suppose. Sure. It's the festival, it looks like. Yep. Yeah, it's a village every 27 years. Should we hit continue, or is someone waiting for you? Just continue. <laughs> we are uh, we are very near death, uh, as you can see from the okay, doom. So. so, festival begins. So we either go to our room or we advance the clock for the festival. Uh, I... what if you feel like it's more? Let's take a look at the festival this time. Is that a human bone? We're about to get attacked by a dog, aren't we? You see- You could see a dog chewing on something in the distance. Is that a human bone? Oh, great! Oh, good lord! Look at that Shiba Inu. Isn't that a cute pupper? I'm gonna kick your ass, partner. There's not enough space. Okay. <laughs> okay, hang on. Oh god. Okay. It didn't. I don't think he. Hit, yeah. Wait, did it hit us? He did us. He, he did. Uh, we lost two Amazing. Health. Amazing. Okay. You do more damage that way, yeah. Motherfucker, uh, he got like some strong. Oh, on wait, him. hold on, hold on. You can uh, you can do desperate struggle, prepare attack, and then heavy attack. Not a bad you're, idea. You're... Prepare attack and then heavy attack. And then just... Nothing, I guess. I want 
want to do something somehow. It's the most we can do. We'll just prepare it again. <sighs> oh god. <sighs> Good. Hey, we got one uh, one uh, stamina back because we are using the carpenter hammer. Hurting other people feels good. Great. Festival grounds are now open for visitors. Maybe you should check it out. We'll go. Locals are seemingly busy. It's getting late. Let's look for some friends for a second. Let's enjoy the festival real quick. It's just a mask, you idiot! Let's look for our friends. You know, let's do this. Let's help our friend. Learn more more about the festival. So we have Kasumi now. Hey, look at that! Nice. That would be really good. Learn more about the festival itself. Word sound wakes you up. Alright, let's continue. Need to explore the forest now. Hooray! Yeah, I do. Onsen sounds good. Thank God, this is what we needed. All right, now we have to explore the forest. At least we got two stamina back, right? What? What's Fuck! It? What? What? Oh God! Uh, it it's a bad time to be out of cash, says the grim-looking man. Who stands in your way our company fortunately specializes in cases like yours and will gladly help you get back on track after all he takes a step closer you can swear there's a faint smell of rust around him everyone has something to sell what does this mean jar of blood fondest memory peace of mind oh. I think Jar of Blood is our stamina, fondest memory is our reason, and peace of- or- Reason is pe- Fondest memory? Piss. Ugh. Everything suddenly gets dark. You feel sad, but can't to even tell why. In your pocket, you find an envelope with cash inside. Something is watching you from behind the trees. Okay. A sudden storm forces you to find shelter in a nearby cave. Looking around, you discover strange marking on the cave walls. Try to decipher them. We don't have a flashlight! Oh, thank God! You recognize the symbols and connect them to the horrors plaguing your town. Going back to your inn, you overhear two mass visitor, uh, villagers awakening at the next dawn. Villagers see we are, all you're ever stuck. We are, we are at 89. Okay, we're going for Osun. 89 what? 91. 91. Doom. We are over 91 Doom. I know, I see it. I don't like it either. Oh. There, there. Oh, would you like to test your luck at this, this fine game? I'm gonna walk away. Why is it so quiet all of a sudden? Where is everybody? 
Alright. I guess we're going into the forest now. Yeah, unfortunately, we have no choice. We have no choice. Ah! I'm gonna kill! Kill! As Steve Harvey once said, KILL! The trees really overhead hope... block the sunlight and you begin to feel gloomy. I really hope we don't get into a combat encounter. God, that would be a shame. We're gonna start running. Start running. <sighs> oh, Five experience. God. That's our strength. We can't rest. There's no resting here. Despite oh, your fuck. best oh. efforts, you feel like the neighborhood is starting to change. It's, it's getting more dangerous. Let's get to the factory. Hello, hey. aunt. Yeah, it's the aunt. Fuck you! <laughs> With a loud bang, the ancient horror disappears and the high priest falls to the floor, grabbing their shoulder... Yeah. Whew. The policeman's just like, fuck you, this mask is nice. <gasps> doom. This is the end, man. This is the end. Literally. 94%. Yeah, the old god stirs. Cut off from, from the, the outside, outside world. world. Oh no, the radio mast... Failure. Yeah, right. Whole town stopped receiving it. This is basically the end right now, isn't it? Yeah. Oh no. Alright, let's do the last one, I suppose, after we take a bath. Alright, we can uh, level up now. Right. Need that reason. Let's just get a little bit of knowledge, I guess. You never know. And then we're going to get our stamina back, I guess. No. Reason. 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 We need the reason. reason. Vicious verses of a violent vigil. Here we fucking go. You received an official looking letter from what what does a law for? Okay, sorry. <clears throat> you received an unofficial looking letter. What does a law firm from Tokyo want from you? We regret to inform you of the passing of our client and your grand uncle. His funeral will, will be preceded by an overnight vigil as per the client's request. There's an address and a list of people expecting to arrive. You don't recognize any of the names. Intrigued, you decide to check it out yourself. What's the worst thing that could happen? Following the directions from the letter, you slowly fight your way through the overgrown forest path. An, over an old mansion looks like it was torn down and rebuilt many times. But where is everybody? Explore the mansion. Boy, that's not good. Yeah. Oh my god, the pair has been following us since this morning. It takes you some time, but finally, you manage to find someone. Is that another guest? You should ask them what's going on here. Four actions on the right allow you to investigate the location and interact with it. Who is that? 
A pair is standing next to a window. The man is muttering something to himself while his wife is observing you with her unnaturally bulgy eyes. The body... The body is laid in the master bedroom. You should pay your respects to him. Or uh, are those gills? I really hope not. I really hope not. Explore the mansion, I guess? We are not about- we, this is about to end real badly. About to explode, I think. No time for it? You gotta be kidding me! No, minus three. It was minus three. Oh, thank god. I, I got scared. I was like, three doom. <laughs> you didn't see the minus. Okay. Pressing a handkerchief to your nose, you enter the dark room. There's no way they allow they allowed your great uncle to just lie here. What was the correct bow clap order? Maybe other guests will know. Uh go to the other guests. You can uh Yeah to this uh no no, no the, the thing in the middle. This? Yeah, the lap they did the corridor. Uh, young one wrinkles her nose when she notices you. You swear you've seen engraved symbol before. You didn't get this with the letter? Here, take mine. Okay. Hang on. So, it depends on the time? Feed the plant in the study with blood, cover the mirror in the storage room, and the vigil. Okay, so at 9 p.m. we have to start the vigil. 10 p.m. we pray over the body with clap bow, clap bow. Okay, so just remember clap bow, clap bow, and then we have to light up the fireplace at 11 p.m. and then 12 a.m. we have to pray over the body again. Clap bow, bow, clap. And then we have to feed the plant with blood, which is probably going to take our stamina. Uh, cover the image in the storage room. Don't know what happens at 4 a.m. And, and we then we end the vigil. Let's go to the bedroom, I guess. Let's pretend like we wanted to be here. What'd you say? Yeah, master bedroom. What time is it? Uh, it's 10 p.m. It's 10 p.m. So, right now. So, Where does right, it say that? Yeah. Uh, if you go to the dilapidated corridor, it, will, it, will, it tells you the time. Right, okay. Uh, so what? Inspect Ins his foot? Copy it into your pamphlet. So it looks like a candelabra. Yeah. So, clap, bow, clap, bow. Okay. And now we explore more. Okay, first off, real quick, look over this again. So we did this. Now we have to light up the fireplace at eleven, and then. Do we really? Do we still need the forest snow? I feel like we can just throw into the storage. Yeah, we can. Never know when you need a tiny key. So, uh. But what do we do? The dilapidated, dilapidated, cor dilapidated corridor. Dilapidated corridor. Oh, hang on one second. Uh, just getting a call, so I just go to pause for a sec. Alright.
And we're back. Sorry about uh, that family likes to call and everything during, uh, surprisingly, during most of these uh, recordings. recordings yeah. It's as if it's just not good timing, I guess. So sorry if anybody yeah. heard anything. Uh, okay. Maybe the other guests will know? Uh, no, we already have prayed. We just, uh, we have prayed, so we just explore the mansion more. I guess so. We are really trying to hold back everything right now. You find a heavy tome wrapped in a moth-eating black velvet in an old locked cabinet. When you remove the book, book's wrappings, you recall in disgust, it's bound in human flesh. We're gonna burn it. Ah, <laughs> thank god. You we are so know. close. We are so close to death. We are whole, we are barely holding the world back right now. <laughs> you may never know what's inside the hideous book, but that's a good thing. I agree. You do not know how much I agree. So it's All a family members are gathered. Hang on. Uh... Yeah, it was the fireplace. 11. Yeah, light up the fireplace. All right. Thank God for perception checks, apparently. Spot some dry firewood and add to the fireplace. Okay, so it's still 11 p.m. Explore that mansion. There's a local legend about a heartbroken seamstress. One stormy night, she broke into a local inn and stitched the unsuspecting guests together. Her final gruesome artwork. Well, that's just a legend, right? Just... It's gonna... midnight. You should go and pray. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna pretend that didn't happen. You know, clap, bow, yeah. bow, clap, right? But clap, bow, bow, clap. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oi. <laughs> it seems that someone has already removed all the furniture from this room. The overgrown plant is casting an unsettling shadow. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. You shudder instantly, recognizing the room from a newspaper photo. Three years ago, a man hanged himself here. Why is a vigil being held in a place like this? Oh boy, that's a pretty good uh, question there, you know? Oh boy, you know? There's a, you can do a thing here. Oh, I can, I can check the wardrobe, oh. Oh, look, meat cleaver. I found a meat cleaver. Isn't that a nice thing? Extra damage against human and monster enemies. Good thing we got. Yeah. Stuff. Yeah. Okie dokie. Let's go and check the dilapidated corridor. Oh look! No one's here! Isn't that a fucking shame? <laughs> there ain't nothing here! We are about to fucking die. <laughs> I thought we did it right! We... I thought we did it right! Uh, I guess we just continue exploring. I hate this place! I can't bow to the clap to the bow bow clap! You... The whole building begins to shake as you enter the room. Suddenly a stone pillar bursts through the floor where you stood just seconds ago. Noticing the arcane symbols painted on the stone, you take a step closer. STUDY! Oh. They shift and change before your eyes. Dizzy, you escape the room as blood oozes from your nose. Ain't that a- You must to find one of the guests. They are shaken, but otherwise safe. You both decide to get the hell out of this place, but the door is gone. Look, it's them. <laughs> this reminds this me of one of my books. Uh, isn't the okay? No, it's one AM, so we 
we just like, continue exploring, I guess. Isn't 1 a.m. where we have to feed the plant? No, it's the next hour. Oh, right, it's 2 a.m. that we have to do that. Shit. We're 99! And... Uh, well... You start to um, miss okay. those obvious leads. Uh, okay, okay. Kathakaturasu is free once again. The invisible strands of the spiderweb slowly cover the entire city, entrapping everyone, including you. Wrapped in a cocoon, suspended in a near-death state, you will wait days. Months, or maybe years, until it's finally your turn to be eaten. Jesus Christ! <laughs> you cause of death! Cause of death! Organs liquefied by Katakatorasu's venom. Uh -huh. Incoming doom, 104%. Well, at but least... But hey, we, hey, we unlocked five new achievements. Hooray! Damn it, I cannot believe that we were so close. Yeah. Ooh. Like, we're so close. We so. did not make it. I gotta be honest, Kuji is easily the worst character. <laughs> you, you, you're saying I chose the worst character? Yeah, like, of the original character, of the original five characters, I'd say Koji is definitely the worst one. You gotta be kidding me, what did I do? I so, I let's see. Button. It's the reset progress button, you need to press okay. two bot different buttons. Alright. So, let's see. Uh, junior Scout, investigate 20 locations with a compass equipped. Unlock a map. locked map. Wait for it. During combat, prepare to strike, but don't attack that turn. Unlocks pocket knife. Uh. Did this true idol at any point in the game? Have four followers. I think we already did that. Yeah, probably. Fit girl. That's the uh, icon. Bad luck, roll of one during a stat check. Unlocks the Hermit. As an ally. God damn it. World Doomed 3. Lose your playthrough due to Doom. Unlocks the Gruesome Totem. Damn. Shirokawa History 1. Unlock 15 achievement. Unlocks City Planning. City Planning. God damn, I cannot believe that. But hey, uh... We did great. <laughs> still, like... We still managed to reach the final mystery. Even though, unfortunately, Doom got to us. Yeah... That was pretty unfortunate. We should've just done that one next. But, oh well. Yeah. I guess, uh, things happen. It's a shame we can't check check the uh, enemies that we found. Damn, I can't believe that. I guess. But maybe, in, uh, but maybe we can uh, manage. Maybe we can manage to uh, save the world in, in the next episode. Who knows? It's a big maybe. <laughs> right now uh, we are 50-50 in with our uh, win loss ratio. I guess so. But yeah, I guess we end the episode here. So, hopefully we'll be able to save the world next time. But until then, we will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye! Bye-o! -bye.